All right, so it's November and we got the Dodge in the garage for the winter now. Got a lot of plans for it this winter. I've already got started on a bunch of stuff. Let me just kind of walk you around and show you where we're at. Uh, so if anybody doesn't know, this is a 1966 Dodge Power Wagon WM300. Currently I'm working on the, well, several things, but uh, the frame extensions here that will uh, allow us to mount the winch in here. And I'll show you the winch that is sitting over here right there on the floor. So that's gonna be mounted right in there. It's a PTO winch. So I just gotta order the, the um, risers and the um, cable guides that go on top of there that the winch mounts down to. So we got these installed. Um, and uh, so that's slowly, slowly getting there. Now the thing I've been working on quite a bit is the running boards. They, um, you know, they're not in the best of shape, but they're in pretty good shape considering the year of them. So we got them kind of dented or banged back in shape, got a lot of the dents out of them. And I started to, you know, put some primer on them and get them cleaned up. So those will be going on. So that's, that's another thing we're working on. And with that, as I got the uh, brackets on, it's gonna hold those. And the blocks of wood, I'm slowly getting those lined up. The bolts will go down through the running boards into the wood and down to the, to the brackets. And now we'll have running boards on here. So we're working on that there as well. Inside the cab, I had to, basically I took all the interior, well, mostly interior out, because I unbolted the whole cab and had to shift things around, shift it back a little bit to allow for that winch to go on the front. So what that meant is I had to unbolt that, I unbolted all the fenders, I unbolted the whole radiator housing up here, uh, undid the hoses, drained the radiator fluid. I actually got all that back together now but oops my light's dying well well hopefully it's not dead but anyway um but yeah i had to shift the whole thing back because one of the bars for the winch bolts back here and it goes just in front of this here and just clears it so we got that set up and ready to go so that's uh looking good um i'll be putting the uh, interior back in it pretty soon uh, it's all just sitting in the back here uh, that jerry can is actually going to be mounted on the running board on that side of the truck we'll get that cleaned up as well and looking good so yeah that's kind of where we're at there's a lot of little projects going on i worked on the emergency brake on it so that would lock uh that wasn't latching good um, so, I mean, it worked good. It just didn't stay locked into position to, to release it and to lock it in. So we're working on that as well. But yeah, this is a 1966 WM300 Dodge Power Wagon. If you have any questions about it, feel free to comment, ask a question. Uh, I'm going to be putting around with this. You'll probably see more videos of this throughout the winter uh, working on it. But that's it.